It's the Joel Shit Show featuring Joel Shit. Hi, welcome to the Joel Shit Show. I'm your host, Joel Shit. So, yesterday was the day, of the final table for the World Series of Poker. And it started at noon, and around 5 o'clock, I went, oh shit, I forgot. So I went online and paid for the pay per view feed, because I don't care if I can hack into it for free. I'll pay 20 bucks for that. And then I got to hear Phil Gordon go on and on and I'll do anything to hear Phil Gordon talk because he's got everything I need insight and a northeast accent and oh, just gets the heart going so uh, I turn it on and there's four people left and then I go to the store and I come back and I turn it on there's still four people left and then around one o'clock they go on a break and I was like man I'm tired so I fall asleep and I'm thinking man there's still four people left and everyone has so many chips like relative to the blinds like the blinds I think were 300,000, 600,000 and like a 75,000 ante or so so that's 1.2 million and everyone had at least 20 million in chips like there's no way that anybody's going to go broke because they're playing like 15 hands an hour because everyone's playing so slowly so it's like I'll just watch the rest of this in the morning I was like well I don't know because I thought that last year and it ended like at 5 something in the morning so Maybe this year, you know, I said, no, it'll be different this year. They'll still be playing in the morning. Well, I guess, like, within an hour after I fell asleep, two people busted out. And then the last guy just kept going all in, and he finally got called. And I understand you're tired. You've been playing since noon. You know, 15 hours is a long time to play poker in a row. And, I mean, I've only played for 13 hours straight. That's my record, although I didn't get a break for dinner. And so I can sort of see why, you know... It just became very crazy, but man, if you could just maintain your composure at the final table and just get some average starting hands, there's no reason why you wouldn't do really well, especially, at, you know, like the war of attrition and all that crap, because, I mean, well, there was a point around midnight where this one guy, the guy who finished third, he kept going all in over and over, like three out of four hands, and I mean, he had like 35 times the big blind. It was just ridiculous. Yeah, he was picking up the blinds and annies, but... If he ran into one kings or queens or aces or something, he would have been sunk. You know, he was obviously on tilt because he had just had bad things happen to him. And then, uh, you know, then he went all in with ace-queen and got called by queens by the big stack, but then he got an ace on the flop. So he ended up blasting in the third. I thought for sure he was just, he's 62 and he's tired and he's from South Africa, so the jet lag and everything, but whatever. So all the time we have for today, visit us on the web at joelshitshow.com. Email joel at joelshitshow.com.